Hi guys, so today I'm going to be doing a little intro video. Um, my name is Monty Dew, and I am officially joining the Mournful Walrus family, as it were. Uh, so you may have seen me around, we've actually done a few co-op videos. We actually did Long Live the Queen together, and I think we've done a few more on this channel. I kind of am in Castlevania, but I'm in the background because I was doing homework and kind of grumpy that day, so I understand if you haven't seen me before, and that's perfectly fine. Uh, so from now on, I do have my own channel, but from now on I will be posting and doing collabs with Stephen Weathers on Mournful Walrus. And so this is my official introduction video. So now I know what you're asking yourself. What is a Mahdi Do? Well, fun fact, I am actually the person in the Mournful Walrus family who is very obsessed with history, mythology, folklore, and things like that. So I'm going to give you a quick lesson on what the Mahdi Do is. Now, um, on the Isle of Man, there is a castle called Peel Castle, and the Mahdi Do. Uh, which was originally called in the accounts of seeing a Mahdi do the moth dog and it was a dog that would walk the hallways of Peel Castle and then would return through the same hallway at the end of the evening. Now I know many people have heard of the black dog. It actually appears in several several things such as Hound of the Baskervilles, uh, such as the Hellhound, uh, and if you're a fan of Gunger Craig Court, which is a Big, I am a huge fan of Gunner Craig Court, uh, the Black Dog, or the Mahdi Do, uh, as spelled in my username, which is where I mainly get my spelling of the username, is actually one of the spiritual guides in the Gunner Craig Court. And I will post a link to that in the description because if you're not reading Gunner Craig Court, you need to get on my level. <laughs> so, Mahdi Do is a black dog, typically seen as an omen of death or an omen of someone's passing, or as an omen of change. In several different versions of the story, the Mahdi Do was actually seen as the protector of the castle, and in one such version of the story, the Mahdi Do would come into the guardroom, lay down next to the fireplace, and then when dawn came, he would walk out. And typically, it was considered very important to stay in the guardroom when this happened. So, now that you know a little bit about the Mahdi Do, uh, I would like you to know that typically in my videos I tend to talk a lot about mythology type things. I will often go on tangents, or if something historical happens, I tend to know a few facts about that. So you're going to hear a lot of rambling from me on things like that, and uh, if you're not into that, I apologize. Okay, and what else can I say? Well, typically the type of games I like to play are a little different from what Steven likes to play. I like to play RPGs, um, sim simulators, I like to play simulators, I like to play dating sims, uh, visual novels and games that tend to have a little more um, on the side of being pretty than what Steven likes. So you'll probably see things such as Dragon Age Inquisition, Transistor, Sims 4, maybe. Uh, visual novels such as Hotful Boyfriend. I may continue my series of that on this channel. And we may even re upload that, but we'll have to see about that. Uh, typically, you will see slightly different games when it comes to me. I'm also a big fan of fighting games, and you will probably see me flailing in rage at several. I'm a big fan of Japanese RPGs as well, so I may play a few of those. And um, I'm a big fan of comics, so. For example, I'm a big fan of the Fable series by Bill Willingham, so you will probably see me play uh, the game by Telltale Stories, uh, what is it called, A Wolf Among Us? I'll probably play that because I was on episode 3 about to finish and I built a new PC and, you know, it's gone now, so I have to redo my files. And what else? I like anime. Uh, I'm actually learning Japanese, so you may see some Japanese pop culture things from me. You will tend to see more Asian-inspired games from me. I'm definitely not in the vein of being an otaku, but you will see, you know, more Asian-influenced things, and I tend to wax um, poetic about the history of Japan and things like that, so if you like a lot of little facts, I'm your girl. And typically, I will talk a lot about Japan because my goal, and I'm currently a college student, I'll say that, Mari Du is currently a college student, her goal is to study abroad soon, so when I transfer I will probably be doing a video series on that, and I don't know if Steven's mentioned it, but he would like to go abroad as well, but I don't know if we'll be going abroad at the same time, so that's like years in advance, don't worry about it, we'll get there when that comes. Uh, so yeah, that's me. 
I will be posting more fighting games. Uh, we've been contemplating different things. We might be doing a Fight Me Friday or like a Retro Wednesday or things like that. And typically on those days, you'll be seeing games by me. Uh, I would like to play Blaz Blue or other things on the Fight Me Friday, so look for a actual announcement from Steven on that. Uh, yeah, it is nice to meet you. Please don't burn me at the stake or stab me in the butt. Um, yeah, see ya, and we'll talk soon.